welcome to my youtube channel today i am going to explain a important part of manufacturing process and production technology and that will be a different work holding devices during the machining operations so basically what happened for the different kind of work holding devices so basically setting of the work material and that will be properly and it is also important for the different kind of points or you can say very carefully consideringly to hold the work correctly onto the table of the machines so that will be all you can considering as a table of the machines or you can use onto the different machine tables so basically first one and that will be the work piece that will be should be rigid to connect to the table so this work piece material that will be rigid or you can say rigid during the cutting operations for any kind of machines you can use on that so for that proper clamping should be done on all around the work piece so there will be no or you can say no degree of freedom of work piece materials so according to the 3 to 1 principle of the work holding device so that will be having enough rigidity during the cutting operations then the work should be properly held on to the surface plane and so that it remains in its proper positions with other surfaces also so that will be all kind of primary requirements of the work holding devices so for that some of the standard clamping devices most commonly used to holding the work piece onto the any machines and that will be discussing in this lecture so starting with the first one t bolt and clamp so just you can see here this one is the t bolt so this t bolt it will be used to holding the work piece so here that will be the t kind of slot that will be providing onto the table so t bolt that will be easily inserting onto that and this t bolt and with the application of the sum of the clamping device or you can say here it will be the clamping device or you can say plate kind of clamping device is being used for top surface support and that will be the another end supports so by the application of the t bolt and uh, this one is a nut and the clamp so t bolt and the clamp these two are used together to hold the work piece of the materials so that will be the most common use into any kind of workshop for holding a work piece materials so that will be the most common things that you can always find into any kind of small or medium scale kind of machine shops second one stop pin kind of work holding devices so just you can see the figure so here it will be table so the stop pin that will be inserting into the table and providing the stop to restrict the sliding movements into this directions so here it will be the work piece materials that will be held onto the table of the machines so that will be restrict the downward motions and from this end that will be providing the supports and just using the stop pins so that will be restrict the movement into left directions so this one the most common use for the workshop for the holding and work piece materials now next one adjustable stops so just there will be some kind of improvement into that particular stop pins 
so here that will be the adjustable stop pin is being replacing by the stop pins so here it will be the stop pins it will be inserting and here that will be providing some kind of adjustments as you can see so by the rotation of this screw mechanism that distance it will be adjusted according to the change of the size of the workpiece so if you want to use large shapes of the workpiece so you can adjusting that distance from the stop pin to the workpiece if you want to use the large so just you can chain like this so by the rotation of this screw or screw mechanisms this distance it may be vary but that will be the similar kind of applications you can find into the stop pins we already discussed but here that will be the adjustable so by the changing the shape and size of the workpiece that will be change and last ones most commonly used in any workshop and that will be the v block so basically v block that will be used for holding and cylindrical kind of job so workpiece that will be cylindrical shape or you can say pipe or you can say hollow pipe is being hold into the v block so here that will be the v block it will be resting on to the machine table and that will be the two columns it will be fixed on to the vertical axis with the machine tables and this two columns it will be attached by the clamp mechanism you can see v clamp mechanism is being used so according to shape and size that will be used so this v block that will be resting on to the machine table on that v shape our cylindrical job that will be easily resting on that particular body and to restrict the upward motions or you can say upward movements that will be restricted by the clamp so here that will be all kind of restriction of the degree of the freedoms by the v block clamping systems so basically all four kind of work holding devices it will be used for most of the machine shops so starting with the first one that will be the t bolt and clamp second one stop pin third one adjustable stops and v block so that will be all regarding to the work holding device so if you like this then subscribe and share thank you very much